Hi everyone, today I'm going to be playing uh, Simbi's Civilization 6, which was just released for Mac uh, whilst I was asleep actually. So in this video I'm going to show how it performs on uh, my Mac, which has the following specifications. Okay, so I'm running a 2.7 gigahertz Intel Core i5. I've got 8, eight gigs of RAM, um, and I also have the Intel Iris uh, Graphics 6100. Um, now there has been some controversy on online about Aspire changing the minimum uh, spec requirements for this game. Um, so if you're not sure if your com computer can run it, I would suggest going onto their Twitter feed where there's quite a few um, other users who've asked about their particular setup. So I'll just show you. As you can see, they've just released it. So there's quite a few um, other people who've asked about their particular setup. So if you're not sure, I suggest ask, ask those guys because they're quite quick at responding. But for now, let's have a look to see how it runs on my computer. Let's go. So far, so good. Here we have Sean Bean crossed with Gerard Butler. You're plotting a new course again, aren't you? The currents before us are ever changing. We must adapt and press forward if we are to see our journey's end. And how will we know when we get there? for a suicide move. We don't actually know if we made that one. And off they go to Alpha Centauri.
okay, first impressions. I kind of missed Civ V's uh, aesthetic, but never mind. Just a load screen. Okay. I think I'm just going to go for play now, just to, you know, get a feel for the game. Um, yeah, let's just go for this one. Ooh, Russia. From the first stirrings of life beneath water, to the great beasts of the Stone Age, to man taking his first upright steps, you have come far. Now begins your greatest quest, from this early cradle of civilization on towards the stars. Embrace the chill winds of the motherland, Sarpita. Okay, so my features and abilities. I receive science, science and culture from trade routes. So and you will learn much from your grand embassies um, to foreign lands. And Only I get extra territory when founding cities. Russia will surely more faith flourish and, and more production. Spread, absorbing okay. all that lies around it. So it looks like I'm going to have to have quick expansion. The greatest land empire seen on this earth. Let's just try to eat up that land. So I get a Lavra, which is a unique district. I forgot what a Lavra is. And a Cossack, which is the same as the five. Okay, let's go. Okay, for this game, obviously I'm not new to Civilization, but I'm new to Civ6. So just for this game. Okay, so first impressions of the graphics. Greetings, uh, my liege. Okay, they're kind of advisor, on a par with Civ I am qualified Five. To I suppose it's hard to tell because there is kind of almost a more cartoonish I am at your um, design for this game. And it is always hard when you compare it with, you know, sort of uh, developer demos, which are obviously using state of the art. Um, Rigs. Okay, right. Uh, let's. I'm guessing it's going to be found Moscow. So I have some dyes down here, some wheat, a couple of mountains. I always like being near a mountain, just because there's always a couple of uh, buildings and wonders which kind of need to be close to mountains. I'm not sure if that's the same in this game. Um, no. I'm just going to move my warrior just to see. So there's anything that I'm missing. Okay. I'm actually going to move my settler one place. Just so I'm kind of more central. And let's found the first city. Ah, St. Petersburg, okay. So actually I have some stone over here and some sheep. The sheep are going to be cold. So I'm going to choose my production down here. Okay, so builders in this game, they work in a bit of a different way. Um, I'm actually going to build a scout first up. Okay, so first, I think I'm going to go for mining. Although I can't get to the stone just yet, maybe I should go for something else. Um, Let's go for pottery, just because I'm right next to that wheat, so I can harvest that pretty quickly. And turn one, turn one of thousands in the next few years is done. Okay, right, let's see what's nearby. Ain't nothing much over there. I have to say, I'm a, I am a big fan of this sort of um, kind of map design for the Fog of War. That's pretty cool. It's kind of much more dynamic than it was before, rather than just, you know, kind of black. 
Who's this guy up here? Oh, that's me. Ooh, okay. I found some fish. Fish, is that barbarians? Tribal village, okay. Appeal, breathtaking, continent Nuna. Is that the name of my continent? Okay. Not quite sure who named that, so I really need to have writing and something. Let's find out. Yeah, promotion, okay. Yes. How do I promote you? Yes. No, okay. Might have done it. Alright, I'm not going to go too far that way. Just because my scout should be... Oh, that's citrus. Okay. And more wheat. That's good. Usually I like to have double of one of the luxury resources. I'm not quite sure how we're so close to Tundra and... Oranges can grow. Doesn't quite make sense. Thank you, lady. All right, let's send him out uh, the other direction. Go for. Uh, let's go for a monument. Okay. Reconnaissance units like scouts are unique in that they uh -huh. can gain experience by here. exploring and discovering parts of the world. Rivers are already annoying me. More wheat. Not the most exciting, but it will come in useful. Deep quote. Deep. Okay, so, uh, I can now build, build a granary. A few new um, technologies compared to the last game, like irrigation. Have I got any marshland? Not at the moment. Um, astrology. And Stonehenge. Oh, I can build a lavra. Okay, I might go for this one just because I kind of want to see what a lavra is. Okay, I'm going to bring him back around. Ah, another tribe. So do these re replace ruins? Maybe. No man ever wetted clay and then left it, as if there would be bricks by chance and fortune. that barbarian again. All right, first bit of combat. Let's see how the game holds up. Okay, so it's just, actually it's just a scout. So that's a bit different because obviously four barbarians wouldn't have scouts, they'd just sort of send a brute or something.
if we zoom in, it's n not the best. Hello. Ah, my own country. Let's go see Victoria. Usually, they just kind of... Ah! Oh, no. Oh, right, well, that's me nuked. Here he is. The most destructive man in the Civ universe. Gandhi. Okay, so compared to all sort of all the press, obviously, on my... Um, computer, there's no movement, it's just a static image. Which, I suppose, is the price you pay for it actually running. Um, am I too busy? Yeah, I kind of don't want to risk it, let's go for it. Come to our nearest city. Uh, yeah, sure, let's, let's go, sounds fun. Okay. So that's a nice little little touch to the game. Oh, they're annoyingly close. Um, cool. So my knowledge of writing's been boosted. Jade. Ah, that's a cool. Cool new luxury resource. I'm still surprised that I haven't met England though. That's a bit odd. So, yeah, they're a bit too close to my liking. So I'm going to bring this scout back around and see where I can potentially. Expand into this area. He's, he's used all his moves. Uh, so that scout's trying to escape. Aha, uh -huh, more citrus. Okay, so I'm definitely going to try and expand down this way. Just so I can have. Going uh, beyond the wall up there. Okay, yeah, I'm sure I can do with some tea. Trying to defeat that before I expand. Let's see if... There she is, Your Majesty. So they have copper. London's looking quite weak. Well, it's the same as mine. <laughs> okay. So, this is... They weren't kidding with the small map. I'm not quite sure if I'm going to build my second city. Grown. Okay, so there's some more dyes.
Okay, right. Okay, so with your people enthused to try code of laws, yeah, it's so exciting. Government and social policy changes are free this turn. Okay. All right, let's have a go. Probably should read the manual, but so military policies, economic policies, diplomatic policies, wildcard policies. Uh, now, the, both of these would be quite useful at the moment. Um, but I have a feeling some barbarians are coming, considering we've seen two barbarian scouts already, so I'm going to put this in here. Um, mm, I think I'm going to go for this one. Is that all I can do for now? What she's done. Okay, let's just go for that for now. Enacting new policies or in our government trade. can be of great um, benefit. Our people await your decree. I do get quite a good benefit from foreign At trade. At his best, man is the noblest of all animals. Separated from law and justice, he is the worst. Okay, so we need some more food. I'm guessing that's focusing on food. Ooh. Okay, that's helped me boost me along. That's good. So, do you get? Is there any bonus for killing my Uh One tile, impossible natural wonder. Okay, so it provides plus two food. So that should be useful for me later in the game. Uh, there are those barbarians. Okay, I kind of need to heal them up before I take them on. Tribe disappeared. Oops. Okay, so this is obviously one of the biggest changes to the games. To the game. Uh, districts. So here we have loads of information. Okay, so I'm guessing this symbol means it's a district, and so I can build a labyrinth district. So, uh, a district unique to Russia for religious activity replaces the holy site district. The city border grows by one tile each time a great. Uh, okay. As it turns out, Mount so it helps me with great people. 
So I had to spend and, two weeks ah, in Tanzania I'm liking talking the look to the people on my trip. Fuck faith from each adjacent natural wonder. That should come in handy. Lots of mountains. That's useful. Tundra. Awesome. So. think as I have citrus and I've dyes I think I'm gonna go for irrigation. Let's choose my production. So these buildings can be in the city center. I think I'm gonna go for a lavra. And I'm guessing I have to choose where. So ooh, okay, that's not what I wanna happen. We have recently gained Hello. advanced knowledge in city planning. Right, Creating districts in our cities can so, be much more powerful and lucrative shows where than simple improvements beneficial. Like I'm farms thinking and maybe mines. going around here. Just because it's next to a mountain. And it's next to tundra. And it's next a to physician to without a knowledge of astrology has no right yeah, to call go, yeah. himself a physician. Okay, so let's get, zoom in on that. Okay, so it's not complete yet, obviously. Right, I need to, uh, promotion available, okay. That's from a while ago. I think I'm gonna go for this one, Battle Cry just because that's who I'm going to be uh, taking on in a second. Okay. Ooh, okay. There's another scout. I would want to build a city over here, so I'm going to explore up this coast. So I'd like to have a coastal city. time. Heal. Heal my scout back up. There we go, first unit defeated. And on that note, I'm gonna leave it here. Uh, thanks for watching. And if you enjoyed this video, uh, click subscribe and you'll be able to watch the next one as well.